The Canberra Deep Space Communication Complex is an Earth station in Australia located at Tidbinbilla in the Australian Capital Territory. Opened in 1965, the complex was used for tracking the Apollo Lunar Module. It is part of the Deep Space Network of NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory JPL, managed in Australia by the Commonwealth Scientific and Industrial Research Organisation Constitution The Canberra Deep Space Communication Complex is an Earth station in Australia that is located in Australia at Tidbinbilla in the Paddies River a tributary of the Cotter River Valley, about 20 km from Canberra in the Australian Capital Territory. The complex is part of the Deep Space Network run by NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory JPL. It is commonly referred to as the Tidbinbilla Deep Space Tracking Station and was officially opened on 19 March 1965 by then Prime Minister of Australia Sir Robert Menzies. The station is separated from Canberra by the Murrumbidgee River and, more importantly, the Coolamon Ridge, Urambi Hills, and Bullen Range, which help shield the dishes from the city's radio frequency RF noise. Located nearby is the Tidbinbilla Nature Reserve. The CSIRO manages most of NASA's activities in Australia. In February 2010 CSIRO took over direct management of the site with the establishment of CAS CSIRO Astronomy and Space Science. Previous to this CDSCC had been managed by external subcontractor organisations, such as Raytheon Australia from 2003 to 2010, Bay Systems formerly British Aerospace Australia 1990 to 2003, AWA Electronic Services minus 1990. History During the mid-1960s NASA built three tracking stations in the Australian Capital Territory. The Tidbinbilla Tracking Station now known as CDSCC, was opened in 1965 and is the only NASA tracking station in Australia still in operation. During the Apollo program, Tidbinbilla was used for tracking the Apollo Lunar Module. The Oral Valley Tracking Station, 35 degrees 37 minutes 43 seconds south, 148 degrees 57 minutes 20.8 seconds east, was opened in May 1965 in what is now part of Namadji National Park. Its role was orbiting satellite support, although it also supported the Apollo Soyuz test project in 1975. It was closed in 1985. Honeysuckle Creek Tracking Station 35 degrees 35 minutes 1 second south 148 degrees 58 minutes 36 seconds east opened in 1967 and was built primarily to support the Apollo moon missions, mainly communications with the Apollo command module. After the cancellation of the Apollo project the station supported Skylab until its re-entry in 1979 when the station joined the Deep Space Network in support of the Viking and Voyager projects. 1981 saw the closure of the station and its 26 m antenna was moved to CDSCC to become known as Deep Space Station 46. After the antenna was removed the rest of the facility was dismantled and knocked down. Its foundation, access road and parking area are all that remains of the facility. Antennas As of late 2016 the station has five large antennas in use, DSS-34, DSS-35, DSS-36, DSS-43, and DSS-45. The CDSCC also uses the Parks Radio Telescope in central New South Wales at busy times to receive data from spacecraft. There has been ongoing construction since 2010 building additional 34 m beam waveguide antenna. Construction of DSS-35 began in July 2010. The station's collimation tower is located approximately 3 km to the northwest, on Black Hill. Um, 
Topic: Funding. CDSCC costs about $20 million per year to run, and is funded by NASA. See also Carnarvon Tracking Station OTC Satellite Earth Station Carnarvon Parks Observatory <laughs>